National Weather Service says stay out of the water and away from dangerous areas like piers and break walls right now. We got a beach hazard statement. It includes Kenosha, Milwaukee, and Racine counties. Fox 6 is Gabrielle Mays. She's at Bradford Beach and shares how to stay safe along Lake Michigan. As kids play in the water to cool off on a warm summer day, Lorraine Moore spends her afternoon enjoying Bradford Beach. I just want to have a free day to um, spend time with them, um, just have, give them a day of fun and a little adventure. She came to the beach with some of the kids who used to attend her daycare. One thing Moore stresses, water safety is key. I talked to them before we even leave the house to let them know that we're going to the beach with water, where there's water. and. Um, you know, it's, I don't want you to, no one to drown. Dave Benjamin, the executive director of the Great Lakes Surf and Rescue Project, says Lake Michigan is the deadliest of all Great Lakes. Because of the high population density along the lake shore, there's a lot of access to water. There's a big lack of lifeguards, and it's also a tourist destination. The National Weather Service issued a beach hazard statement from 4 p.m. Tuesday to 7 a.m. Wednesday for Kenosha, Milwaukee, and Racine counties, saying a backdoor cold front today will result in dangerous conditions along Lake Michigan beaches. The swim risk is high. Your chance of drowning in the Great Lakes is less than 1% if you're wearing a life jacket. So that's based on the statistics that we have compiled over the last 10 years. Benjamin offers this advice if you're struggling with water over your head. You're going to have to float first, exit strategy second, because if you don't float first and stay at the surface and then you submerge, you're not going to have the opportunity for an exit strategy. Gabrielle Mays reporting. Gabrielle spoke with more before today's beach hazard statement was issued. For those who live in Ozaki and Sheboygan counties, beach hazard statement has been issued until tomorrow morning at 4.